Hey, I'm Nick Boy, and welcome to a Pocket Livestream. How's everybody going? I'm looking at Undertale today. Welcome, all of you. Uh, thank you very much for your patience. There were some technical issues uh, and an extremely long render for today's episode, which features Bajo. Uh, which is probably why. His laugh was making the render go for far too long. How are you all? I see lots of people. Holy crap. Everyone, hello, Kit Carnage, Farm Boy, Salad Horse, Leo, Leone, Leone U, Jeff Tastic, Violet Wind, Pink Girl, Clad Bikini, Twenty One, and Emerson Vandy. How are you all? Thank you very much for hanging out. Um, like I said, today I'm playing Undertale, not Undertow, which is a different game. Undertale, which I have not played yet. It was on my Christmas wish list for like things I would do over the Christmas break. But recently I've decided that over the Christmas play break, I may play nothing, just so I can have just a break. Just make the noise and the pixels stop. But before I get into this, uh, the very important business of why you're here, free shiz. And this week's free shiz is t-shirts, uh, as always. So you can win yourself your very own Puck Tears t-shirt. All you need to do is go to the Good Game Twitter account, twitter.com, twitter.com, forward slash Good Game ABC TV. And, uh, wait, is it? Or is it Good Game TV? Good Game TV. Twitter.com forward slash Good Game TV. There is a picture of me, and I believe Bajo on there. Uh, you take that picture, you Photoshop it, you add a caption, you do something. You do something creative for once in your life. And you, uh, send it back. You include me in your ads, at Nickboy. And most importantly, you include hashtag GGP shirt. And uh, at the end of this stream, at about 4.45, so uh, relatively soon, uh, we will be uh, picking a winner for the second last t-shirt to be given away this year. Go. Uh, before I start, as always with me, the incomparable Pete. Hello, I'm on the other side of the microphone today. You're never gonna get picked up on this directional bad boy. And John, ladies and gentlemen. Hello. What was that? What do you mean? Hello! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> he really did sound like a British cartoon character. Hello, everybody. Okay, um... Nick Boy, this is my first time watching with my new Twitch account. Well done, Infinity Twitch account. I enjoy the fact that your Twitch account username includes the words Twitch account. Maybe you didn't know that that would be the case? Think it ahead, though, making sure it's safe. Um... Let's play this game. Am I gonna like this? I'm worried that I'm not gonna like it, and then I'm gonna be ostracized from the gaming community. But let's find out. Ow. <clears throat> uh, you did miss a very short cutscene, uh, which said um, uh, humans and monsters were warring, and uh, and then and then the humans won and they locked the monsters away. That's all I know. Name the fallen human. Does it know I'm on a keyboard? Can I just type in N? Nope. That's weird. Uh, Nick. Oh, these jumbly letters are making me nauseous. Boy is my name. Playing games on the internet is my game. Except those two weeks, which are coming up. Oh, it's gonna be so sweet. I can finally stop. You called yourself Nick B? No, it isn't correct. <laughs> I love this game already. Okay, Nick boy. Oh, it's because it runs out of letters. Ah. Nick Bo. Nick Bo or Nick B? Nick B? Nick by. Nick boy. Nick boy. Nick. There's no other way I can do it. I could spell Nick correctly, but I won't. Uh, let's go Nick by. No, let's go Nick Bo, because it's also my dog. It's not how he spells his name, but that's not how you spell Nick either. So, we work well spell? together. My dog can spell. Genius dog. Take out the H. Alright. Nanto Paku Paku. Get out of here! Nick Bo is exactly what I wanted. 
<clears throat> hey, all right. Uh, is that a bed? Flowers? I'm gonna say flowers. That is adorable. Let's go through here. More flowers. Hello, Kampachi. Last night on Good Game, did the director know you were gonna do the Sharon Stone beaver shot? So, I probably shouldn't have read that out loud. Um, yeah, they did. And I was like, oh, that's strange that that's cropped out. But uh, we did a couple of takes. I think they used the third take. I did it on all three. You'll never see my crotch. It was there. I was wearing a very open cut pair of jeans. Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hello, Flowey. Hmm. You're new to the underground, aren't ya? Golly, you must be so confused. I am. How does a flower grow underground? Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess a little on me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. Wait, he stole my heart. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of levels. I assume LV is levels. What's LV stand for? Well, love, of course. I was wrong. I was actually wrong. If I gain a lot of love. So you want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. All right, flower, I just met you. Let's uh, pull back. Pull back on the love sharing. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. What? Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. Yeah, I'm gonna get those pellets. You idiot! What? Oh my god. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? What? Die? No! No! This flower's a real son of a bitch. I'm so glad the demon came and helped me. What a terrible creature torturing such a poor innocent youth. Well, that was a twist! Controlled by a flower. Nick was wrong, everybody shouted out. What was I wrong about? Nick boy was wrong. What? Oh, levels. Oh, levels. Oh, right. I thought you meant something serious. Uh, uh, do not be afraid, my child. I'm Tareel, caretaker of the runes. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You're the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. Terrific. This way. Ugh. No, I'm just a kid. Okay. Can I, can I have that thing? Shadow of the Ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Let's save, just to be safe. I like the style. Goat mom is best mom. Jar Jar Binks times goat. <laughs> Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Why, why don't you just let me up, back up? Why can't I just go back up? You got a ladder down here? Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. You seem to have switches and levers and stuff. You must have ladder technology! <sighs> the ruins are full of puzzles, ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. I can see why Gus hated this game. I can see why Goose says this is the worst game of 2015. <laughs> and you should tweet him and tell him that ask him why he thinks Undertale is, quote, the worst game he's ever played. Tweet him that. At Goose Mangus. Goose Mangus. Goose Mangus. 
Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Alrighty. Everything's looking pretty dandy. Can that button move? Everything's good. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Press Z. Oh, to read signs, but I pressed enter. So I'm gonna press enter instead, stay on the path. All right, sorry sign. I'm such a sheep. Worst game in 2015, Goose knows nothing about games. You let him know. You let him know on Twitter. Tell him Nick sent you. He'll know what it means. It means Nick sent him. Uh, okay, flipping switches. Splendid. Oh no, is this another trap? I'm very proud of you, little one. This doesn't feel good. Let's move to the next room. Oh no. Wait, what if I flip this one? This switch doesn't even work. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> Hashtag blot. <laughs> Nick is always trying to get us to tweet at all the other GG people. I'm just trying to share the love. I feel like they deserve some attention. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for a time, I will continue, I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Interesting fight mechanics. This is a game I could get behind. Look, we're Eskimo kissing. We're Eskimo kissing. Hey, we're just little Eskimos right now. It's uh, Nick Boy and Snoopy. You encountered the dummy. Yes, I did. What is that? Hiss. Oh, it's, oh, the font is so big. Dummy looks like it's going to fall over. Good stuff. Um, do I use a mouse? What do I do? Maybe I use a mouse. Act. Wait, what's happening? Why am I fighting it? I don't want to... There we go. There we go. Act. I'm going to give you... Act on the dummy. Talk. Here we go. You talk to the dummy. Doesn't seem much for conversation. Well, it is a dummy. Tareel seems happy with you. You won! You earned zero XP and zero gold. Doesn't seem worth it. Ah, very good. You are very good. <laughs> I didn't mean to fight Lariana. It didn't give me, like, I didn't, I just hit enter. Always act, never fight. Guys, I got it. I'm not gonna fight. I'm gonna love the dummies. I was just a dummy and I hit the wrong button. There is another puzzle in this room. Can I fight it? Uh, I'm gonna shoot it in the face. Wonder if you can solve it. Let's find out. Whoa. Oh no, frog, it attacks you. Hey, frog, let's just have a conversation about this. Check, compliment, threat. I'm so sorry I'm yawning so much. It is so unbecoming of a Nick boy. I'm a little tired. Compliment. Frog, it didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Oh, that's nice. It looks like his testicles are blinking at me. Um... Out of the way. And the frog just slowly slides away. You earn zero gold and zero XP. I would love some gold and or some XP. What does this sign say? The western room is in the eastern room's the wait. Bleh. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Right. So they're both the same room. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. Oh, she's like Jesus. There was only one set of footprints in this hand because I don't exist and so I didn't come down to help you. <laughs> John liked that. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. 
Um, you have done excellently thus far, my child. Excellent. So, what have we learned so far? One, um, you want to talk to everything. Two, nothing understands you. Three, you don't get any reward for anything you do. And fourth, you will be fine at all the puzzles as long as mum is there to hold your hand. Alrighty. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. Uh, I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Oh no. This is a trap. This is a red hot trap. Wow, she ran away fast. Hang on a sec. Where did she go? Abandoned! Again! Ah, oh, you were just hiding. Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. What the crap is going on? Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise to test your independence. You must attend to some business. You must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It is dangerous to explore by yourself. I'm definitely going to do that. I will give you a cell phone? You couldn't get reception down here. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? I will try. Oh, old testy frog. This is too real. Well, <laughs> she... <laughs> she is pretty needy. Uh, there are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Be good, alright? You're not my real mom! What's wrong? The yawning. So much yawning. What's wrong with you? I don't know. I don't know. Can we get like a fan? <laughs> or a block of ice or something to oh, suck on? Yeah, that'd be nice. That would be nice. Actually, I really want a Coke. Like, um, Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I learned, I learned how to speak frog. When does Parker Prime usually get uploaded? That's a good question. Usually 3.30. But it was processing. 3.30. It's processing. Uh, excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. That's probably a good thing, right? If a monster does not want to fight you, please use some mercy. Ribbit. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. HP fully restored. Right. Oh, that's cute. You save the game by running through leaves. Uh-oh. Oh, that friggin' frog! We just had a conversation! Frog it. You're sexy. Frog it. Blushes deeply. Rip it. Mm, frog it loves it. Frog it seems reluctant to fight you. I'll show you mercy. You won! You earned two gold! Yeah. Yeah. Uh oh, what's this thing? Alright. Alright. Frog! Is it the same frog? Compliment the frog. Yeah. Hey frog it, I like the shade of your blinking testes. Blushes deeply. Rip it. Frog it seems reluctant to fight you. Frog it, I'm gonna give you another compliment. You're welcome, frog it. Oh yeah. Uh, wait. He's attacking you, Yeah, he's jumping at me. Yeah. Just kill him. 
How do I how do I get out of this? I can't hit escape. Wait. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. What's check? All oh, right. Life is difficult for this enemy. Oh no, he's gonna hop at my heart again. You can move the heart. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Oh, can you still move yeah, the heart? Yeah, yeah. Oh right. You gotta dodge those. Things. Oh cool. Okay, great. Yeah, no, that's fine. Nickbo, stay determined. Come on. So yeah, once you commit to either fighting, acting, right, anything, you're committed to that. Right. But I think like sometimes you want to hit something once. Yeah. To okay. Kind of bash it a little bit. To just freak like, it out, and then I can like show up mercy. It or yeah, yeah, it yeah. Right. Okay. Cool. Wait. No. Don't fight. Oh, why? Why? <laughs> oh, these stupid controls. <clears throat> Okay, cool. Alright, I see the point now. Yeah, this is fine. Yeah, you missed everything. Um, act. Wingsome. Console. It's okay. Halfway through your first word, Wingsome bursts into tears and runs away. Beautiful. You won. I earned zero gold. Awesome. Not worth it at all. Should have killed you. Uh, let's try this one, because the other two... Nope! Excellent! Oh, interesting. It is all random encounters. <coughs> random encounters is a strike against this game. Um, Wingsome approached meekly. Wingsome. What's up, baby? Halfway through your first word, Wingsome bursts into tears and runs away. I won with but a word. But I got nothing for it. Do I only get gold when I hurt something? That would be interesting. Hello, this is Tareel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer, cinnamon or butterscotch? You apparently can press X to go back. Oh, cool. You can press X to go back. Uh, a phone call bishop says, when the name is yellow, you can mercy. Um, Excellent. Cool, I'll give you other tips as they come. Yeah, beautiful. Okay, back is all I actually needed. Sometimes the screen comes up and I'm like, Yes, and then you know, I'm committing to fighting. Um, I prefer cinnamon or butterscotch. Cinnamon or butterscotch. Cinnamon, butterscotch. I do like cinnamon buns, cinnamon drinks. I only like butterscotch pudding. Cinnamon. Oh, I see. Well, she obviously made me a butterscotch cake and I've really offended her. Um, click. Ring, hello, this is Tareel. You do not dislike butterscotch, do you? <gasps> um, trying to fatten them up. I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Yeah. She wants a piece of my tum. Three out of four grey rocks recommend you push them. Huh. Oh. Oh, Wingsome, get out of here! I console you, and halfway through your first word, wings and bursts into tears and runs away. You won, you went zero, zero. Let's try something else next time we come up against one of these guys. Uh, let's push that onto there. What does that do? Excellent. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. It's like I'm doing so well. Uh, what does this say? Please don't step on the leaves. Oh no. Okay, Wingsum, you're really pissing me off. Wingsum freaks out. I can't handle this. Wingsum. Wingsum is hyperventilating. Get out of here, Wingsome. Mercy? Not yet. Not yet? You don't reckon? It was Mercy when the name's yellow, wasn't it? That's what I... That's what... That's what I'm gonna see what happens if I... If it doesn't... Yeah, see? We're fine. Okay, let's go back. Oh. 
not recognise the pattern here? This, between this floor and the other one? Yeah. The leaves are falling through the holes that you're falling through. Ah ha ha! I would have got it the next time. Uh, Mold Small blocked the way. Oh, you're new. Act. Flirt? Things just got honey pop. You wiggle your hips. Mold Small wigg wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. Oh, wait, but you're still gonna attack me. Oh, oh, oh. The aroma of lime gelatin wafts through. What is happening in this game? Imitate. You lie immobile with Mold Small. You feel like you understand the world a little better. But he still attacks me. Or it. This thing. Mold Small waits. Mold Small. Flirt. Wiggle your hips. Wiggle his back. Meaningful convo. Oh, no. Do I have items? No, I don't. Show mercy. Spare. You won! Okay, so we go down. We go around. We go down. Okay. We go here. We go down. We go around. Uh, was it about here? We go up. So far, so good. <clears throat> um. Uh Froggit and Wingsome drew near- Oh, there's two of them! Oh, crap! Guys. Okay, so, yellow means... What? You know, just have highlights No. The heart highlights. That means you can show mercy to that one. Right. Or does it? He said- There was somebody said when the spare says he's yellow. But I guess yellow means it's better yeah. to go that far than to go the other one. I don't know. Where are you, Froggy? Whoa! Holy crap! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Froggy seems right click to fight you. Good! Mercy! Spare! I'll spare you both! I'll take your sweet gold, though. Oh, so close. <laughs> Just a tiny bit over. Okay. So, a little over there, and then I get to there. We've all noticed the child is obviously a Simpson bastard. Uh, there, 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 there. Yes. Wingsome approached meekly. Oh, Wings. Oh no, I'm fighting it. Ah, stupid buttons. I'm so sorry, Wingsome. Time to die. Wingsome avoids eye contact. Yeah, you get out of here, Wingsome. All right, push these onto here. One. Oh, these random battles. You tripped into a line of mold smalls. Um... Wait, what is this straw pole? Did you start this? No. It's, uh... Was what? It the butterscotch Yeah, what is the yeah. pocket live stream like more butterscotch or cinnamon? The answer is cinnamon. Yes! Yes! You magnificent people. Um, okay. You tripped into a line of mold smalls. Okay, so there's a bunch of them. Um, guys, I think you all... Oh, I can't do multiple things. I think you all look great. You all look terrific. But you're still gonna fight me, aren't you? Oh, crap. Crap. The aroma of lime gelatin wafts through. Um, nope. Back. Mercy. Spare. Can I just mercy everyone straight up? I don't seem to be getting anything for like, um, for, uh, flirting with them or talking to them or anything. Well there, partner, you said, who said you could push me around? I'm sorry. I just assumed you were a rock because you're a rock. 
Just for you, pumpkin. Huh? You want me to move some more? Yes, I do. Now this, oh, pump, oh, pumpkin rock. You are testing my patience. That's the wrong direction. Good boy. All girl rock. You. Yeah. <laughs> yes. No, I'm not. I just wanted you to stay. If the monster's name is yellow, you can go into Mercy and spare it, and all the yellow ones will go away. Any white ones, you need to convince them until they turn yellow. Terrific. <laughs> gonna save this sweet weekend. Absolutely. Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Uh, can I take the- am I the mouse? I will take the cheese. It's stuck to the table, I'm just gonna have to take the table. I cannot take the table. Alright, what have we got here? A sleeping ghost. Oh, it's fake sleeping. This ghost keeps saying Z. <laughs> ah. uh, move it with force? No, not with force. With love. With love is not an option? Yes. Here comes the nap stab look. Alrighty. Uh, I'm gonna flirt with it. I'd just weigh you down. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> the combat is cool. It's definitely, um,. Yeah, it's interesting. Like, it's kind of stressful. Um... Okay. He's staring into the distance. Now is my time to show you mercy. Nope! Really not feeling up to it right now, sorry. Wishing it wasn't here. I just gave you the option to leave. Oh, you should cheer it up, because it's crying. I give Napstab look a patient smile. Ha! Huh. Oh, that didn't help at all. Oh, I did it. <laughs> I did so well. Didn't get hit once. Oh, wow. Uh, Napstab looks just a little bit better. Right, so this is a game of like... I take all the hits until everybody feels better. Uh, I told you a joke. Unfortunately, it was a joke about a ghost, and you didn't take it very well. How many tweets have you received? Have you got a lot of tweets, buddy? What are you doing, man? Have you got a lot of tweets? I got a fair few. Yeah? Yeah. Oh. I'm, you shouldn't have hated the game. I didn't hate the game! You said to me earlier today it was the worst game you've ever played. Why? <laughs> Why would he do this? I've already... I... I'm <laughs> done. Oh uh, no, don't look at me! <laughs> what an entrance! <laughs> what are you doing, man? Uh, how many? Crap game. How many did you get? Like fifteen or sixteen. That's, that's not nice. That's a lot for me. Yeah, that's a lot for me for people to be going. Why do you hate something? Are you enjoying it? Uh, so well, like I'm not very far in. I'm figuring. I'm figuring it out. Mm. The combat. Mm. I'm annoyed that I'm annoyed with random encounters. That's what I'm annoyed with. Yeah, that's the worst part yeah. of Pokemon. Like, like, yeah, it's like, just... Like, some repelled, man. Just, yeah, I just hate random Are encounters. Are you listening to the music? No, because we couldn't figure out how to put the, um... The music is actually the best part. That's the best thing in the game. Well, hang on, I'm, I'm not making any... Combat. Oh, I'm annoyed that... I'm annoyed... Yeah, uh, we couldn't... We were having a problem with this, so I... The, they're listening to the music. Oh, good. I'm not. It's not the best... I'm not gonna make any... Complete... Yeah. Does it, like... Best music of 2015, worst game of 2015. Yeah, no, it's like a good combination. Yeah, it is the best music of 2015. Yeah, and it was one guy who did it. Yeah, cool. Also made the crap game. Good game. 
I liked it a lot. Leave me alone, you people. Uh, cheering seems to have improved. Next stab looks mood again. Excellent. Can I leave? Oh, I can't leave yet. What's going on? Nap oh no, it's this one. No, not this one. Cheering seems to improve. Nap stabs look again. Yeah, good. I cheer you up again. Wants to show you something. Oh, come on. This is just an abusive situation. Oh. Oh. That's a nice little penis hat you've grown. Napstag eagerly awaits your response. My response is I'm gonna flee. <laughs> oh no, don't cry at me. Okay, this is cool. I'm definitely cheering it up though. We'll just cheer you up again. Oh gee. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around, but today I met somebody nice. I'm rethinking everything. I'm going to become a man again. I'm a human. I'll get out of your way. That's so nice. Okay, that's cool. So this is a story about a kid just going around improving everybody's life. Um... <clears throat> okay. Um... What did I miss with Goose? Uh, moving on. Spider's webs. Can I take them? No. <gasps> Leave seven gold pieces in the web. What? What? Hang on, let me read that sign again. No. Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real. All proceeds go to real spiders. Okay, so I go here. I have negative six. Gold. So I can't do any of that. I think it's just. I think it's gold. just six gold. That was just a point. Oh, that's just a space. Uh, well, I may as well buy something because I'm. Oh no, I can't. I've only got seven gold. I mean, I need seven gold. What happens if I select yes? You didn't have enough gold. All right. Hmm. Look at those swinging testes. Did you miss it? No, I saw it. Come eat food made by spiders, for spiders, of spiders. Uh, rivet, rivet. My friend never listens to me. That's a shame. Whenever I talk, they skip through my words by pressing X. It sounds like goose. That's right, pressing X. I'm doing it. I'm <laughs> There's <laughs> a lot of things coming out of my mouth <laughs> on this stream. Uh, what do spiders bake? That's a very good question. Can you play through the game and fight and kill everything? I assume you can. Oh, not you too. I'm sorry, Spidey. Hey, what's your problem? Uh, yep. What does F4 stand for? Four frogs. I have only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. Alright. I've heard you are quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now that a monster wears a yellow name when you can spare it. What do you think of that? Very helpful. It's rather helpful. It's very helpful. Remember, sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day you'll have to do it even if their name isn't yellow. I've actually been there a couple of times already. Oh, mum. Leave me alone. I just realized that it's been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying around here and there. I bet they're bones of human children. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. You will want to leave room in your pockets for that. Alrighty then. Mom's house. Oh! Loving it. <clears throat> um, we broke Goose. Finally some vulnerability. He isn't perfect. Yes, welcome to our world. Uh, you blessed me from Queensland. Well, thank you, Super Chicken. 
There's just one switch. <clears throat> what happens if I fall down these holes? Should I try? Oh, random encounter. Oh, look at this guy. Looks drew near. Hey, looks. Um, I don't want to pick on you. Finally, someone gets it. He says as he punches my child face. Looks gnashes its teeth. Looks, oh, he was pink. I mean yellow. <clears throat> I'm still not gonna pick on you. I am going to show you mercy and spare you. I won five gold. Uh, okay, I need to do something here. I need to get to that lever in the top left. Oh wait, there was a pineapple down there. And probably talk to that ghost. Vegetoid came out of the earth. That is a creepy thing. Vegetoid, talk. Plants can't talk, Doey. <gasps> but what are you doing right now? Oh, you're a bad, you're a bad animal. What's dinner as opposed to devour? Attack six, defense six, serving size one monster, not monitored by the USDA. Um, oh crap, that, even that triggers a fight. Oh no! Killed by a tomato! <clears throat> Maybe I can flee. No, oh, I got away. Okay, the... Oh no, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Do I have any items? Nothing. Not even a friggin' spider cookie to my name. Vegetoid. I'm just gonna eat you, I'm sorry. You tried to eat Vegetoid, but it wasn't weakened enough. I just made it angry. Ah, oh, Vegetoid's here for your health. No, Vegetoid! You're like evil, healthy Harold. What's dinner? You pat your stomach, Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. Ah! Oh, but that green probably would have given me some life. Interesting. Our fate rests on you, Nickbo. <laughs> okay. Not impressed with Vegetoid. Uh, and also. Like, look at the effort that Gus went to. He had to find... He had to, like, <laughs> find someone to be his friend to take that picture. He hasn't got a lot of friends left <clears throat> after that worst game of the year comment. Yeah. Either. They've all turned on him. Okay. <clears throat> Press X to pay respects. How far back did I go? Oh, do I need to fight the ghost again? Oy vey. Oy vey. Uh, I'm just gonna skip through all this. Cheer you up, May. Um, who in the chat has played this game? I told you a joke, and in fact, you are really not feeling up to it right now. Sorry. Luckily, I was out there. Cheering up, gonna cheer you up again. Wants to show you something. Now you cry upwards. Yes. And you made yourself a little hat. Uh, played a bit. Me, me. Nope, not me. I haven't turned him. Tweet Nick about his love for ESO. Sure. I crave your attention. So anything you say just feeds the monster. And you're saying that semi-sarcastically, but it's actually true. 
I realize I don't crave it. Like, I don't feel alone when no one tweets me like Gus does. Yeah. This is nice. But I'm not pathetic. Sleepy boy. I say sleepy because he was just lying down. Um, <laughs> I'm actually the sleepy boy. Uh, the... Okay, the ghost and I are buddies. <clears throat> Do I have any more gold? I don't think so. No. Nope. I will go this way. Hello, Soviet Reaper. Uh, I know all your messages, frogs. Wait, there's a frog missing. Hang on a second. There's a friggin' frog missing from here. Where did that frog go? <gasps> did you guys eat the frog? Uh, you. Well, mercy spare you. <clears throat> what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Wait, you're just gonna dance at me? Oh, he's pretty cool. Yeah, I'll spare you too. Ah, <clears throat> uh, here we go. I think I have eight gold pieces now. Maybe I'll go buy a spider coin. Yes. Some spiders crawled down and gave you a donut. How terrific. So hopefully I can eat that. I don't want to run to that veggie again though. I did not care for him. Uh, let's go this one. I think this is where the leave was. Correct the mundo. Is that? Yes. I'm gonna have to fight those stupid vegetables again. Um. <clears throat> Don't pick on. It's fine, buddy. He's gazing at me. Oh, I can dismiss him. You're dismissed, son. Goodbye. Hey, it's mom's place. Spider donut. That sounds sticky, says contact lust. Agreed. Is it a cinnamon donut? That is a very good question. Can I open the inventory here? I don't think I can. I will check. I transitioned that into a yawn. I didn't mean to. In this game, you can kill no one to get a different ending. Have I? I haven't killed anyone yet, have I? <clears throat> The far door is not an exit, it simply it simply marks a rotation in perspective. Okay. It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. Is mum behind a pillar? It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. Listen, veggie! Bugger off! Um, <clears throat> okay, what worked last time? I said dinner, and he would have given me like a health bump, I assume. But it didn't seem to do anything. Did it? I don't know. I died too quickly. Nothing else seemed to have any effect on him. Punch him and then, and then give him show Oh, can I fight them? I think as long as you don't kill them. Right, okay. Maybe he just needs a good slap. I sound like a terrible father. Alright, kid. Get over here. Uh, I think you missed entirely. Oh, do I need to do something? Yeah, when that beam moves across, you need to hit like... Oh, it would be great if this game actually told me a piece of information. Closer to the center, the more damage you do. Yeah, right. Oh, this game needs to start explaining things. Okay. Um, now, I don't want to kill you because I want to look like a good guy for everybody on the internet and that I made it through this game without hurting anybody. Uh, Vegetoid, let's check your... Oh, I can't see your health at all. So what if I attack him too much? 
<clears throat> no, the happy ending isn't gone. The carrot, the stupid evil carrot's alive. People are saying no. People are saying, Pete, no, what have you done? RIP everything. Peter should peter off. I punch a vegetable. Nothing else was working. Nothing else was working. Like, I try to I try to talk, plants can't talk. You just have to run away from that one. Well that's stupid. That's stupid. Maybe that would be my first instinct as well though. Like if like a vegetable the size of rad came up to me. So like a very small vegetable. Yeah. And was like, I'm gonna eat you. Yeah. I'd probably run. Oh, because I was going to say, if a vegetable the size of Rad came up to me, I would have the same reaction as to do with Rad, which I'll punch it in the face. Mm. She'll, she'll come in here in about yeah, 30 seconds. Yeah. yeah. You want me? You want? Mm. Yeah. And then I'll do one of these. And she'll go, no! no, no. <laughs> uh, we have fun here. Three, <laughs> two... <laughs> Where am I up to? Yeah, we're definitely at mid rad conversation on the stream. You noticed there was a blue switch behind the top pillar. Oh, hidden switches. It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Yo, what'd you say? <laughs> <laughs> I actually don't know because I was helping Gus with something, oh, no. and then I came back. Were you taking more like pathetic pictures of him? I just think. No. I was going. She, that you took nine pictures. He was like, oh, let me just change position. Let me suck my thumb now. Let me just like crawl closer to that end. Amazing. What did you say about me? No, we were saying the veggies. I got in trouble from the chat for punching a veggie in the face because there was nothing else that could happen. And we said, yeah. and, then, and then Pete goes, well, my natural reaction if a veggie the size of Rad came up to me would be to run away. Yeah. And I said my natural reaction if a veggie the size of Rag came up to me is, would be my reaction when Rag comes up to me, which is to punch her in the face. See? She loves it. My good buddy, Nick. It's done to <laughs> Um, okay. Yeah, good. You wouldn't eat it? The veggie? It's got a really terrifying face. I think none of these. Oh. Okay, don't hit any obvious switches. I don't know about this game yet, guys. I don't know about this game yet. Is it trying too hard? Is that what's happening? Uh, you have to eat one of the green things when you choose dinner, then you can spare it. Right. That's Scooty McBooty. Uh, thank you, Coming Scooty. To live on Twitter. Oh no, it's the friggin' veggie. Oh. Okay, so I'm gonna eat you up real nice. But first, spider donut. What does that do? 20 health. Brilliant. Oh crap. Whoa! Yeah, that was easier than I thought. Um, vegetoid dinner. You pat your stomach, vegetoid offers a healthy meal. I think I got it. Vegetoid gave a mysterious smile. Ooh. He likes being eaten. Vegetoid's a masochist. Uh, miss a gulp. Wait, I should just dismiss. Let's dismiss just to be safe. Nothing like alone time. Ew. Why do you just dance at me? You don't do anything. Miss a gulp. Get out of here. Okay, I need to open that thing. If you can read this, press the red switch. Random encounters! You are spared. I'm just gonna dance. Um. Hey Nick boy, it's Matt. I don't know if you guys know about this, but I think we broke Goose. Um, 
he'll be fine. Uh, hey Nick, were you hi when you were hired, did you watch Good Game and just really want to be a part of it? Uh, or oh, before you were hired. Um, I watched Good Game. Yeah, I was like, yeah, that would be a cool job. But I watched Good Game for years. So, yes. When Janet offered me the job, I was like, I'll do it. That sounds like a fun job. But, but before, all the years before that, I had already had a job. I was functionally employed, paying my taxes. I was paying good game salary, man. Um, act. Dismiss. Red button. It's a switch, press it. Yes. You hear a clicking sound. And away, away go. I just love, I just looked down and I just saw this comment, which I love. Seven Hunter asks, does anyone else hear vape? <laughs> and I was like, <laughs> I don't know why that made me laugh, but it did. Um, Nick, he's the evil one. Um, this game looks cool if it wasn't for the random encounters. I tend to agree that random encounters just are never a good idea. If you could read this, press the green switch. There is no green switch. Oh, unless it's hiding behind a pillar. Um... Listen, looks. I'm not gonna pick on you, but I'm gonna move around here a little bit to get out of your way. And you are dismissed. Good day. I said good day. Where is the green switch? There. Yes. Here's what I don't like about random encounters. They. Not only are they just frustrating because they just pop up when you're not necessarily in a place where you want to do that, but they discourage exploration for me. Like, I will not go to, like, in this game, for example, sometimes there's, you know, vines on a wall. I won't go explore those vines to see if there's something in them because I'll be like, oh, the more I walk around, the more chance there is I'm just going to trigger just a fight. Um, see, like, right now, just gonna commit. There's a tree. Oh dear. That took longer than I thought it would. What have you done, Mum? What have you done? How'd you get here, my child? Listen. We've known each other for like 10 minutes. There, there. I will heal you up. I should not have left you alone for so long. Oh, I always irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Surprise! It's a tree. Ah, uh, now let's just save. Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. Um. What am I trying to say? Is, uh, is there going to be a good game video game? How is it not told about this? Apparently, there is. I've seen some very interesting documents. Do you smell that? Oh, is it cinnamon? If you bake me butterscotch, I swear to God. Surprise! After you specifically asked me. You specifically asked me what I preferred, and you still put in butterscotch. You're a goat. You're a real goat. So I'll hold off on snail pie for tonight, not gonna eat that. Here, I have another surprise for you. Huh. I know you love, uh, I know you love, um, I know you love movies. So here's a movie of me chopping up your parents. I guess I'll try to say that she takes my words and she twists them. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Yeah, cool. Okay, get your hand off my head. Is something burning? Make yourself a time. Oh no, the butterscotch! <laughs> oh, cool. I'm a little concerned that the room was already set up. Like, does she have kids? If so, where are those kids? 
if she doesn't have kids, is she one of those people that like pretends they have kids to get kids over and then keep those kids? Just force butterscotch down their throat? You know those people? One of those yep. people. Um, yeah. Nick, don't spoil the ending. Oh, we ain't getting to the end. We're not getting to the end of this. We're going for another, what, 25 minutes. Oh, I turned off the light. A box of kid shoes in a disparity of sizes. See? Warning. Right there. If you go into a kid's room and their shoes are all different sizes, multiple kids have been eaten in that room. Don't oh, trust the goat. Has grown up and then kept the shoes for sentimental reasons. Like a freak, Pete? Is that what so you the, do? The person that eats children is less of a freak than the person that eats the shoes? Yes, because that eats the shoes. Sorry, eats the children. <laughs> Eats the children. No, what? Keeps the shoes. I'm so confused. You're trying to say the person who eats children is less of a freak than someone who keeps their old shoes. I'm trying to say the opposite. Yeah, you're trying to say that the person, yeah. But I would say, I would say the child eater is more socially acceptable. Mm. I got no reason why. <clears throat> Let's go sleepies. They're all, <laughs> they're all in the pie. It's kid pie. <laughs> Good work, Simo Gaming. <clears throat> oh, the poll was 50-50, so that's why it's butterscotch and cinnamon. You guys. Whoever said don't spoil the ending really overestimates Nick Boy's gaming ability. <laughs> well, the crap is that? That's cheap shot. It's more than it's like a six hour game and we stream it for two hours. You're a bad person, T. Peter. I used to like you. You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. I'm not gonna eat it. I'm not gonna. Hmm. You have seen this type of plant before, but do not know its name. It's probably kid plant. What's in here? Mum's sex dungeon. Ah, the cactus. Truly the most, what? What is that word? Sundeer? Do you know that word? No. What does that but, word mean? But, but it's the same spelling as tsunami, so it would be just be... Yeah, sun, sun deer. Sundeer? Yeah. Sundeer, yeah. John? I missed it. It's still on screen. Is it? I'm gonna Google it. Truly the most sundeer of plants. <clears throat> Uh, Japanese term for a character development process that describes a person who is initially cold or even hostile, but gradually shows their warmer side over time. That's a terrible way to describe a cactus. A cactus is spiky. Full stop. <laughs> so it's one of those Japanese words that like wraps up an emotion. Like, yeah. yeah. Cool. 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 Um, <clears throat> alright. Sorry, I'm just scrolling through the chat to see if T. Peter's decided to apologise. Um... Oh wow, everyone's pasting that in there. Soon dare... Soon dare e. Soon dare Yeah. Cool. Interesting. We all learned something. And is it Tareel? I assume her name is Tareel. It's Tareel's diary. Read the circled passage. <gasps> Ooh. Do I read her diary? Do I read her diary? Are you a bad human? You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. The rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber. <laughs> cool. So does that mean I can now use that as a joke? Against the the people who I, like the sad ghost I told a joke to? But did I end up, I don't remember, I don't think it ever said the joke. It just said you said a joke. Yeah, and it said I'm not in the mood. Definitely bigger than a twin size bed. It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods, known more commonly as water sausages. Why is mum reading about water sausages? You pick inside, scandalous. It's Tareel's sock drawer. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, I hope she doesn't find out that I went through all of her stuff. Apparently it's Toriel as a pun. Toriel. A play on tutorial. <laughs> right, okay, cool. Yeah, right. If I was going for the pun, I would have tried to spell it like tutorial spelt. Like the second half of tutorial? Yeah. With an A? Yeah. Not an E? Yeah. Would have been... This is my bad De Niro. <laughs> Robert De Niro just pretty much goes... Room under renovations. Don't like that. I was in taxi driver. Not comfortable with any of this. I was in taxi driver. <laughs> Uh, let's see what's cooking in the kitchen. Wait, is that her? Or is that her old mother? Love already, I see. Oh yeah, I went to sleep. I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. Oh. Oh no! <clears throat> oh no. Oh no. I don't want... I don't want you to eat me. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. No! No, I don't want to do any of this. I just want to play video games. I want to engage in your family things. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. You've got me trapped! This may come as a surprise to you. I legally own you now. But I have always wanted to be a teacher. And a mother of a slave. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? Yes. Out! Nick Bai want out. No, wait, what's my name? Nick Bo. <laughs> what is it? When can I go home? Yes, sir. What? This? This is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? How to Exit the Ruins. Um, how about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails sometimes flip their digestive systems as they mature? Interesting. How to Exit the Ruins. I have to do something. Stay here. This kid is in so much fucking trouble. <laughs> May as well, how about I save you some time, Toriel, and I'll just climb into the oven myself. The stovetop is very clean. Oh no. There's some delicious pie there. The size of the pie intimidates you too much to eat it. <laughs> uh, T. Peter finally apologized. Sorry, Nick boy, just trying to get back on Goose's behalf because uh, he's too busy crying under the table. It's okay. Goose can look after himself. And T. Peter, apology accepted. You are, of course, again, as you were before, my favorite pocketing. <laughs> Um, guys, how fast is ABC internet? All I have is ADSL. It's faster than that. Um, <laughs> that's such a random... <laughs> what? Uh, I mean, it's, it's fast. You can... It's... it's, it's yeah, it's like the, it's the fastest internet I've ever used in my entire life. Yeah. Like, it's... it's that's so, it's fun. designed... It's, it's designed to beam video all across the like we take in you know video from overseas offices and stuff and pouring down like gigs and gigs worth of news stuff so it's um uh, the pipe is big the pipe's about this big you know that big pipe near your house that big we need to take hingers out out where to dinner oh yeah that's nice yeah, let's take Hingers out to dinner. Shall we? Let's do it. Oh, it's because of last night's episode. Yeah, right. They're concerned because he seems like he's just sexing people in WoW all the time. 
No, no, he's got to go. Yeah. Uh, she's a uh, night elf. <laughs> Level 76, I believe. Uh, these books are worn. They must have been read many times. Okay, where did you go? I'm gonna go upstairs, but I reckon you may have run to your bedroom to write in your diary about how your new captive is not being very nice. It's Trail's diary. Read the circle passage. Yes, is there a new one? You read the passage. Why did the... No, we know all this. No, I don't want to do it again! Nick, what have you done? They want to hunt me down now. <laughs> T. Peter, I'm sorry. T. Peter? Is it because you were so mean to me that you broke my little heart? Or was it because I said that you were my favorite Pocketeer? Because, um, you are not my favorite Pocketeer. You are all my favorite Pocketeers. You are all better than me. And I'm your favorite Peter. And Peter's definitely my favorite Peter. So you back off, T. Peter. Oh, no, I don't like a lot. Hey, there you are. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. Why is it one way? I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No! Mum! Mum! Mummy! 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 Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they... Asgore will kill you. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Mummy! 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 Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Mummy! Mummy! You want to leave so badly? Humph! You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh, God. Ah! Oh. You're a bad parent. Act. Talk. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Oh ah! Mum's giant hand. Wait, really? Do I need to fight you? You tried to think of something to say again, but... Terrell looks through you. Fight to the death. Here we go. Why are you killing your mum? Fight or mercy? What did you do? She's about to wreck shop, that's what. Wait, what? I don't get it. Same thing is up with Gigi Jacinta. Yeah, that's a good one. Um, please just have mercy on her. Yeah, I'm... I don't... I spare you? Nope. She didn't like that. What kind of messed up parent are you? Prepares a magical attack. Do I have any items? Oh, I'll eat that pie you gave me. Huh, using your own crap pie against you, aren't I, Mom? She looks through you. Um... What do I do here? Everyone in the chat is clearly very invested in this game. Get her health down. Take her down and get the goat cheese. Remember she gave you cinnamon pie. I ate the pie! I don't want to punch her because I got in so much trouble from everybody before for punching. But she won't listen to reason. And I can't show mercy on her. Do I have to punch her? Punch. I'm just gonna punch her. She's uh, she's trapping me in the house. She's a goat as well. She's just a goat. It wouldn't even feel it. Punch a goat. You have to fight. They headbutt stuff. I'm gonna punch the shit out of this goat. Come here, goat. Boom! Right in the face. 22 goat points. Oh no. Oh crap. By the way, uh, I know I'm about to die, but you know, she shouldn't be calling me uh, my kid the whole time, as opposed to my child. Of course. She's a goat. Yeah. A goat pee. Goat kids. Goat kids. Um, I got no more health. Spare her, please! 
Punch the goat. Punch the goat. You'll regret this. Please spare. Okay. Guys. Like, look. Mercy, I go spare. She attacks me. Nothing seems to change. Watch what happens. This will forever be known as the day when Nick should have punched a goat. <laughs> Trail is acting aloof. Spare. Spare. This game. She looks through you. <clears throat> Her reactions are slightly different every time, aren't they? Yeah, like, they, they seem to be going around me. But also the, like, text box. Looks through you. Uh, up the top, like oh, right. What are you doing? Right. Just give it one more punch. <laughs> 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 uh, attack or run away? Get out of here. Just give it one more punch. Oh. Uh. I'm proving that I'm better than you, Mum. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. this chat right now it's just it's a combination of spare her and punch her in the face one more spare hit her one more time tell her her own joke <laughs> that's like a backhanded I read your diary <laughs> so what I just keep sparing you Seriously, do I just keep sparing her? Is that what's happening here? Oh, I could be. Oh, look at those sad little goat eyes. Look at her. Look at her. Okay. Guys. I know that you're all going, like, spare her, show mercy, you know, like, make sure that she's okay. You can't tell because she's just a picture standing there. But when I hit spare, and then she does... Okay, she's stopped now. But when I hit spare, and those little things come down... I want you to imagine a goat on her hind legs raining blows down on a child. Like, that's what you need to think is happening. Because that is, like, that heart is your heart, and if it gets hit enough, you die. She's trying to punch a child to death, and you're like, no, spare her. I don't want to live with you. After you've hit me so many times that I needed to eat pie so I wouldn't die. I'm sorry, goat mum. We can't be friends. Because you punched me in the face. Pathetic is it not, I cannot save even a single child. Yes. To quote Moulin Rouge, hurt her to save her. You would be unhappy trapped down here. She won't kill you, though. What is, what's that got to do with anything? If you saw a mother hitting a child, would you go, Oh, it's fine. She's not going to kill it. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I'll put them aside. 
If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, I will punch you in the back of the head. Please do not come back. I hope you understand. Get off me, Mum. Goodbye. Goodbye. Could not have got out of there faster. And good timing. Yeah, Pretty this seems like a good place to leave it. <clears throat> as just was. I'm going to emerge in the ruins and we will end the stream there. How many children has she hoarded? Oh, this fucking flower. Oh, wait, I can't leave it here. I gotta save, right? Yeah. Clever, very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So, were you able to play by your own rules? You spared the life of a single person. Hee 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 hee. I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer like that mom who just punched you? <clears throat> you'll die and you'll die and you'll die until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration or will you give up entirely on this world and let me inherit the power to control it? I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. This is so much more interesting. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, go away. Undertale! By Toby Fox. Son of a puncher. Cool. Um, I want to save the game. I just want to save it so that I'm safe. Come on, glittery thing. No, I thought something was there. Come on, glittery thing. Oh, there was something there. Okay, we're just gonna leave this. We'll just leave it like this. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Save points in another 10 to 15 minutes. Try pressing Alt F4. Very funny, Blue Pie Ninja. You just made it to my Peter list. 10 to 15 minutes? <clears throat> okay. Um, cool. Yeah, interesting. Interesting. <clears throat> I need to play more of it. I feel like it's... There's stuff here that I like. Like, the conversation idea and that sort of thing are things that I like. But, um... I wonder if... Um... I wonder if it's trying a little hard? I don't know. Can't make up my mind yet. Glad I've started playing it, though. We'll definitely be playing it. Hey, Battlefront. <clears throat> So, Nick has a Peter list. Yeah. Um, uh, Whoopsie Goldberg, I'm not sure yet. Infinity, I'm glad. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, Whoopsie Goldberg, I'm, uh, I mean, I think it is worth a play. It's only like 10 bucks. Like, everyone says it's amazing. Uh, and and most, of the th most of the things that I've read so far have been it picks up four hours in. Like, that's when you start going, oh, wow, this is really, really different. So, uh, yeah, the story ramps up, apparently. So, we'll, uh, we will see, won't we? Um, but for now, we're going to get to the shirt competition. Nick boy, I need to redeem myself. What do I do? <laughs> Listen, Peter, you don't need to redeem yourself because you're the uh, namesake of the Peter list, which are people who have made me so angry that I make lists named after them. <clears throat> So far, I only have a Peter list. So what does that say? Huh? All right. You're fine. You've done well. 
Uh, will you stream more of it? I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know. Probably not. Probably not. Because I, I won't really stream it on my own account because I'm about to go on holidays. Uh, and next week we'll do something else. Yeah, interesting though. This would be a good game for some next year stuff. If it came out next year. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it would be. Yeah. This would have been an appropriate game for next year. Let's just put it that way. Okay. <clears throat> Petey. Let's do it. I've emailed you. Do you want to open them up? I'll, I will hold off for a second. One, two, three, four, five finalists. Oh! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Finalist number one. Look who it is. Mr. List. <laughs> Mr. List. Oh, you cut me to the quick. <clears throat> uh, pro dating advice from Nick. See, then I gave her a watermelon. Bajo says I should have used that tactic with my dwarf in Dragon Age. I like it because you watch the episodes. Should have given her a watermelon. I'm just waiting for the chat to catch up with the fact that T. Peter was uh, one of the finalists. There it is! <laughs> well, this is awkward, says T. Peter. <laughs> <laughs> What's gonna happen, I wonder? Um, <clears throat> terrific. Terrific stuff. Um, okay. Uh, uh, see, and then I gave her a watermelon. Should've used that tactic with my dwarf in Dragon Age. I do like the fact that I am so proud of the fact that I gave her a watermelon in that picture. <laughs> well done. Um, our final, uh, not our second finalist, not our final finalist, our second finalist is Maiden Muse. <clears throat> you see that? It's a pocketeer being hunted down by other pocketeers. <laughs> Again, so proud. And also Bajo disturbingly into it. Not seen in this picture, his erection. Um, I like it. This is good stuff. I, it, it really captures the, um, the sort of gleeful joy that I have pitting you all against one another. Um, okay. That's a good one. Uh, number three. Finalist, Thria Uno, is Kevin. Ladi Kev. Ladi Kev pops up a bit in this. Yeah. Yeah. He's got some good ideas. You He's also some, a dancer. You do some good work. Has he won? No. Have any of these people won? I don't believe so. Maybe Muse, if you want a t-shirt. Hey, it says Undertale has at least five dogs. So, it might be hard to see. Your screen's a bit dark. Yeah. The small circle is the cat that you murdered in the Witcher 3. Oh, no. And then last week's... The screen, deer I the shot. Deer. Oh no! So it's you being quite gleeful <clears throat> about the fact that you've got something else to hunt. Oh, that's some... You really went back and found some stuff for that. That's some good stuff. Okay. You know we outnumber Nick, right? Says pseudonym. Yeah, no, but I'm in the ABC. Untouchable. Until our funding is pulled. Uh, our fourth finalist is James Stewart. See, Bajo, if you look here, you can actually see there are light RPG mechanics. Tell that to the ABC IT department. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. <laughs> if you look closely here and here, they are technically light RPG mechanics. Oh, that's good, James Stewart. Well done. Um, <clears throat> and finally... Finally, finally, finally. Beck. Bunny Lop. What about that dark shadowy place over there? That's Goose's happy place. You must never go there, Nick boy. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Oh, wonderful. I like that she said that in as well and said, Ugh, so bad at these. <laughs> and she's a finalist. Uh, well done, Beck. Beck, James, Kevin, Elizabeth, Peter. Who, who, who should win? Okay, I'm gonna narrow it down to... <laughs> I 
I'm gonna narrow it down to James and Beck. Uh, Kevin, Elizabeth, and Peter, thank you for playing. They were very good. They were very good. Even yours, Peter. Um, <laughs> I love watching John laugh off camera. Because he's so happy, but he's very quiet. Um, okay. I know who has to win. The winner purely on the fact that... I l okay. The winner is, well, technically the winner is Nick's face, because that's what makes this work so well. But I think the winner is Beck. The winner is Beck because what about that dark shadowy place over there? I'm so happy about having spotted the one vulnerability in the impenetrable shell that is Goose. Uh, well done, Beck. Thank you very much. Uh, James, you did very well as well because, you know... Technically, there are some light RPG mechanics in that game. Uh, that game's surprisingly good. Did you know there's a sequel? Yeah. Not nearly as wholesome. I <laughs> know. Oh, um, Lion King, Lion King. I don't know what that means, but yes. Well done, Beck. <clears throat> Everyone well, did very a, well. It's the reference to the Lion King. When Simba says to Mufasa, what about that dark shadowy place? And Mufasa Oh, says, I didn't even get the reference! You must never go there. Because oh. the elephant graveyard and Whoopi Goldberg's there. I didn't even get the reference. I was just like, yeah, I'm I'm tickled by the fact that I can see how to hurt a man the most. <laughs> <laughs> uh, terrific work, <laughs> Beck. Please start running. Um, thank you very much, everyone, for playing along. Um, uh, there is another stream next week, by the way. A lot of people are confused about that. Oh, yeah, we're streaming. Yeah. Did, did I start no, no, server? No, you didn't say anything. Yeah. It was just people right. have been tweeting and Facebooking and... Yeah, yeah, we got one more stream. We got one full week left. A full week of pocket. A full pocket. Plus a live stream. <clears throat> You've lost my respect now. Oh, is this because I didn't get the Lion King reference? Uh, you didn't get the reference, Nick. Stop, please. What are you talking about? A anyway. Anyway. I'm not going to take this on. I'm not going to take on your criticisms about not remembering lines from movies. I am on screen so often everything is merged into one giant continuous blob. Um, what have we got to say? Uh, watch today's episode pod with Baja. Yep. And yourself. Yep. Oh! Know. I'll tell you. Oh, <laughs> Main Muse says, Nick, you'll quote Moulin Rouge during a stream but not get the Lion King reference. That is because Moulin Rouge is a better film. Um, <laughs> there is, uh, uh, there's gonna be this. Oh, yeah. There's gonna be a change in the air. Uh, we, and we've already shot it, haven't we? <laughs> yeah, there's like multiple things that we, yeah, interesting. You're gonna have to post it in there. <laughs> um, what's your personal account just in case you ever stream it's Nick Boy it is Nick Boy um, <clears throat> uh, yes what do we got Dota 10v10 tweet me for details yes we're trying to do that Dota 10v10 thing we've got to figure out a time for that we wanted to do it as the last live stream but it's, it's a bit too much of a hassle with our stupid firewall here because we can't use this, we can't use the snazzy ABC internet. Um, uh, and connect to the Dota servers at the same time. And we need the snazzy internet to stream. And we need to be able to connect to Dota servers. So we'll try to figure out a time. So, um... There's already a time slated. Oh yeah, that's um, right. Yeah, it's... Saturday... <coughs> Saturday? No. 16th. Oh, it was, it was the, it's the day of next week. So Wednesday. Yeah. Next, next week. Next yes. Week. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, that night. It's like Wednesday night. Yeah. Right. Okay. Or right. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll try to do that. Yeah. All right. Yeah. And I'm gonna try and stream it from home. Oh, cool. So it will be watchable. And whose voices will you hear? <laughs> Either no ones or everyone. <laughs> yeah. Um, be brave. Use your 4G. So we would totally do that as well, except 
our particular pocket of the ABC building has no phone reception. We tried to do that uh, for a different situation. Pete, what are you doing? This is a nice idea. But Keep drawing things. That's all I've got. Yeah, just doodle away. <laughs> just doodle away. Um, uh, okay, cool. Sorry, I'm just catching up with the chat. Are you guys going to st stick with Twitch? I'm in regional WA and YouTube gaming streams work so much better for my Twitch, uh, for your internet. Unfortunately, we are going to st stick with Twitch for the time being because YouTube sometimes doesn't play well with us. Um, so, yeah, not not the best. Um, and yes, and also, our YouTube is currently geoblocked. Are you drawing me? Oh, wow. Nickbo. <laughs> <laughs> We should get a cartoonist in, no offense, um, and <laughs> and they should just be- Gus is quite good, and actually Shackers is quite good at doing, doing little cartoons. Doing live cartooning, like it's Hey Hey It's Saturday. Yeah. So like during the stream, you just have that stuff being drawn up on the side, that would be a great idea. Um, <clears throat> okay, cool. Uh, all good, upside down, upside down. Um, um, Yes, you forgot the beard. Draw in the beard. Uh, but where on that gigantic mouth of yours? <laughs> it's like, it's just... Uh, I've got the perfect tool. <laughs> Terrific. There you go. Oh yeah, it's stunning. It's stunning. Um, okay, cool. <clears throat> um, Nick, make the face! There we go. Look at that chiseled jaw. Yeah, you... Uh, no, yeah! My, oh, my jaw's... Okay. Nah. <laughs> 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 oh, brilliant. Uh, did you get any balls? Yes, I did. It was wonderful. It was really good. <clears throat> the puppy is good. Uh, we're done. We are done. Um, thank you very much, everyone, for, uh, hanging out and watching. Um, I'm gonna play more of this game and continue to mull over what I think about it. So far, random encounter encounters, no, no. And, uh, punching goat mum, no, no. Uh, you, today we have, okay, and just to wrap it up, uh, today, uh, Bajo and I look at Xenoblade Chronicles X. And then tomorrow... It's tomorrow. Thursday. What's tomorrow? <laughs> oh, uh, oh, Dr. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Dr. Uh, tomorrow is Lewis Dr. Lustigov and the Emerald Tiger something, 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 something. It's, it's the game from William Pugh who made the Stanley Parable. So both of the Stanley Parable guys have made uh, small games and released them this year. Check that out. Because it's worth it. Is Maybelline. Um, and uh, Friday, we've got a scary game. Very scary. <clears throat> Very oh, scary? scary. Scary ish. Yeah. Yeah. A couple of good screams. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah, you get a few screams. Yeah, it? yeah, yeah. Uh, and we check out a scary game on Friday. So that's good. Um, and then we've got a very cool thing next week that I can't talk about yet, but I'm excited to try it. And for like, because I want to know what it is. The thing we're doing on Friday. Bubble tea? <laughs> <laughs> I tried bubble tea. Did you? Uh, yeah. I did not care for it. Well, it was fine. It was just like cold tea. Uh, yeah, yeah. Thick straws. No bueno. Uh, no, the thing that we're doing on Friday. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah something very cool, which will be Monday's episode. All right. We're done. <laughs> Someone just asked, is it anal beads? <laughs> so bubble tea was pretty close. Uh, all right. That's it for today's stream. Thank you very much, my pocketeers. Follow me on Twitter at NickBoy. Follow John at GG Edit Monkey. Follow Pete at Piereth. Like Pierre with a TH on the end. Follow Gus. Please follow Goose. <laughs> just tweet him now and just tell him that I hate him. No, tweet him and say, like, we love you. Uh, say, at GooseManGus, we love you. Full stop, love, comma, the pocketeers. I was doing a really nice thing until you just burst in. A really nice thing. Cancel what I just said. <laughs>
No, don't do it because he, he burst in here pretending to be angry, but he's actually like, you know, he's an insecure little puppy. Also, has anyone noticed that he looks exactly like the main character from Don't Starve? He looks exactly yeah, like the main character it. from Don't Starve. All right. <clears throat> Thanks very much, everybody. I love you all. Thanks for hanging out. Goodbye. Pete, hit the button. Yeah, it's coming.